Hello, boys and girls. It's Mr. McMahon. And today I'd like to read you Henry Hikes to Fitchburg. And it's written by D.B. Johnson. Now, back in 2003, this was nominated for Children's Book of the Year. So it gets a special stamp that says it was nominated for that. Here's our title page, Henry Hikes to Fitchburg. By D. B. Johnson. One summer day, Henry and his friend decided to go to Fitchburg to see the country. I'll walk, said Henry. It's the fastest way to travel. I'll work, Henry's friend said, until I have the money to buy a ticket to ride the train to Fitchburg. We'll see who gets there first. His friend waved. Enjoy your walk, he said. Henry walked down the road to Fitchburg. Enjoy your work, he called back. Henry's friend filled the wood box in Mrs. Alcotti's kitchen. Ten cents. Henry hopped from rock to rock across the Sudbury River. His friend swept out the post office, five cents. Henry carved a walking stick, 25 miles to Fitchburg. Henry's friend pull, pulled all the weeds in Mr. Hawthorne's garden, 15 cents. Henry put ferns and flowers in a book and pressed them. His friend painted the fence in front of the courthouse, 10 cents. Henry walked on stone walls. Henry's friend moved the bookcases in Mr. Emerson's study, 15 cents. Henry climbed a tree, 18 miles to Fitchburg. His friend carried water to the cows grazing on the grass in town, five cents. Henry made a raft and paddled up the Nashua River. Henry's friend cleaned out Mrs. Thoreau's chicken house, 10 cents. Henry crossed a swamp and found a bird's nest in the grass. 12 miles to Fitchburg. His friend carried flour from the mill to the village baker, 20 cents. Henry found a honey tree. Henry's friend ran to the train station to buy his ticket to Fitchburg, 90 cents. Henry jumped into a pond seven miles to Fitchburg. His friend sat on the train in a tangle of people. Henry ate his way through a blackberry patch. Henry's friend got off the train at Fitchburg Station just as the sun was setting. Henry took a shortcut. One mile to Fitchburg. His friend was sitting in the moonlight when Henry arrived. The train was faster, he said. Henry took a small pail from his pack. I know, he smiled. I stopped for blackberries. And that is Henry Hikes to Fitchburg by D.B. Johnson. Thank you for listening. Bye.